Yeah, yeah. All right, so we did see some Cure Rash er earlier today on stream. And now we got Elliot. So, man, the the land of the Luigi's doesn't it it, it, it keeps Never going. Never fails. No matter Never the fails. generation, it's still going. We even had Toncon a couple of weeks ago. So yeah, yeah. Man, we could have had all three of them. The, in one the place. Luigi. This is like the, the Luigi, Luigi trifecta. Like, <laughs> the it's like the mentorship gauntlet. You know what I mean? Toncon oh. to Elegant, Elegant to Cure Rash. Yeah. I didn't. I didn't realize we have a mentoring program like that. I gotta, gotta the put land that of in Luigi's, my resume. Man. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So this matchup, Kairos is on <laughs> the Young Link, and apparently Young Link sucks. Which I, I definitely, I definitely feel that. You know what I mean? I feel like Young Link is definitely <laughs> around. Like it's like a, it's 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 like Fox. You know? <laughs> okay. I'll, I'll give you that. Yeah, right, it like, is like Fox. Like, right, like you, you, can you rush know in. the character doesn't suck. Like, whenever I complain about Fox, I know Fox doesn't suck. But, like, he, he like, kind of does. You know, he, he kind of does, <laughs> he, but he's, like, good enough. Fox is good enough. Y Young Link, good enough, right? He, You're he definitely in the good in enough In certain tier. situations, yes. yeah. There he you does go, suck in certain situations. Luigi kind of sucks. But then Luigi's I, also kind of broken, right? You, you know what? You have a point there. Yeah, Luigi does kind of suck. But at the same time, <laughs> well, as soon as he gets that grab, you know, he kind of doesn't suck anymore. Yeah. <laughs> The up smash out of shield and wow, a pretty early KO. Uh, 113, obviously, Young Link. Uh, not the heaviest on the cast here. Wow, co connects the boomerang but doesn't pull the trigger. Probably could have been at least an error, if not an up smash. Ward Air should do the trick here. Ward Air up air would have definitely done it. So, I mean, Luigi traditionally always going to struggle with some of those projectile characters you can't get in, but already elegant, making up that percent. Yeah, of course, having access to the tornado with, that has those invulnerability frames. Uh, it's gonna be a great use, especially when Luigi is trying to recover back on stage. Yeah, you're trying to fall and your, your opponent's trying to push button, guess what? You spin it. One thing I really enjoy about Elegant and how he plays Luigi, it, I feel like a lot of Luigi's at zero, they make it like blatantly obvious, like, yeah, I'm trying to I'm trying to zero death you. Like, yeah, like I'm you running. Know at I'm you know I'm trying to zero death you, I know I'm trying to zero to death you. I got the Z button ready. <laughs> Elegant like already has gone through that phase through like multiple different games, right? So it's like, <laughs> all right, like I don't mind like, you know, cashing out for free because you're avoiding my zero to death so much. I'm gonna get an aerial string and just keep playing, you know what I mean? Yeah. And I feel like when you play like that, that's when it's like, maybe you'll catch them slipping. You know what I'm saying? Like maybe oh, yeah. later on in the set, you'll catch them slipping. Because at that point, you you know, you're conditioning your opponent to like, right. this guy doesn't just run up and try and grab me. He's like checking my shield. He's yeah. crossing me up. I, I got to respect a lot more than just grab. So re-grab here. Oh, uh, that should that? be. Yeah. Oh. Just in case he went to ledge, just in case the drift in, covering both options. High enough percent. Tries to get the double flame arrow here. Grab comes out, but the Nair just snuffs it out. Yeah, that, I think that move alone will, will always make me disagree that, that Young Link does not suck. Young Link definitely like is <laughs> one of those volatile characters where you, you see you see this kind of stuff. Ooh, oh, ooh, that, that was a like jab a, block? That was, definitely a, that was a jab block with F tilt. Okay, tech chase. Okay, dash tag does connect. And look at this, 66%. Man, yeah, check the ledge. Check the ledge a bit. Now we're going for like pretty safe uh, plunger setups on the ledge. Just going for ledge traps. I love the down tilt ledge trapping. I've always been a fan. Very, very good move. Very low cooldown. Kairos finds himself on the, the back end of an up smash. So finding his way back into center stage. And will he be able to take one more stock? Or is Elegant going to two stock this man? Oh, there it is. The Nair out of shield. Young Link sucks. But the survivability <laughs> on Elegant, I like that Elegant was playing the center stage. He had, and he, he, that Nair hit him center stage. You couldn't be safer than that in terms of positioning. So really good job to Elegant. He was able to tack on a bunch of percent, just played it very clean. Very nice risk award. Going high here, do we have the double jump? Yes, we do. Order comes up, the bomb, bomb should blow up. Do we capitalize off of it? So in that scenario right there, you always just combo off the bomb hit. You know the bomb's gonna blow up. So you, you set up a situation where it's like, okay, I have double jump. And he gets chopped anyway. But yeah, I mean, elegant still what gets you're it. Going for it. Yeah, yeah, right, yeah. right. But like, when in a situation like that, especially with no double jump, like you can combo off of the bomb explosion, which is what elegant tried to do. He missed it, and he still cleaned up the edge guard anyway. But yeah, I mean, just, just really, in terms of elegance positioning and like the late game decision making, mm -hmm. um, just mm -hmm. in very incredible. Luigi doesn't have the best recovery. Any kind of bomb or sour nair shenanigans off stage, you know, he could have just lost that game. But he played it very, very safe. Center stage control, phenomenal. I mean, for for a character that has like such bad recovery, Luigi. Elegant makes it work in his favor. Like he always, oh yeah, kind of like, almost getting... baits it in like your opponent to to like, yeah, come and challenge me. I'm I'm a sitting duck out here. Please 
and then he uh, reverses you. Yeah. And Elegant's definitely not, this ain't news to him, like, in terms of getting camped. Elegant, Elegant's <laughs> been getting camped for years. Like, yeah. he knows Literal. the deal. <laughs> he knows years. the deal. He, he picked <laughs> Luigi. He, You know what you sign up for when you play Luigi. Like, nobody wants to play with you. <laughs> like, in Man, terms of just, like. Pick for a last in dodgeball and nah, basketball. Like, no one wants no to, like, wants fight to play you. With no, you. No, no, no one wants to, like, fight you. You know what I mean? Because, like, grab for grab, you're done. Like, Sit in the corner and think about your life decision. No one wants to play with you. <laughs> Okay, tries to go for the up smash here. Still gets a ledge trap. Look at all these trades, though. Yeah, that was a trade that Kairos needed, too. That down air connected. You know he's going to be in prime spot to get upbeat by L again. But look at this. Throwing out projectiles. The fire arrow tacking on a little bit of extra damage with the boomerang. Oh, this down beat. Okay, watch the DI. That was almost it. Setting up the plungers here. Both bombs go away. And the reverse, but the bomb's going to explode. Wait, do you combo off of it? Oh, yes, you do. He was ready. He Kairos. listened to your advice. Be ready for that bomb explosion and be ready to convert. Oh, we got a two for two. Two for two. Let's go. Two for two. We're out here. We're clean up in here. Oh, oh, do, oh do we oh, get these? Oh, oh, oh we, we, we hit them with oh. the remix? The what? Is that the, the reset? The, like the, the fireball reset? That's the 2021 reset. What the <laughs> heck? Uh-oh. 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 Oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. oh okay, okay. okay. <laughs> We're... Both players are good. Do you have double jump? Yes, you do. Okay, okay. We're back. We're back. Yeah, yeah. All right. We chill. We chill. We got hit by the fireball remix into the almost zero to death. And uh, the town and city almost happened. Yeah, I mean, even uh, especially when the platform is going out like that, that's definitely a setup where, you know, Youngling can get the falling bear into rising bear, double jump bear up the. Okay, but here we go. It's oh, oh, that was so close. If he was ready for that uh, whip punish there, the shield looking really low. Yeah, you got to roll away. Just escape. Don't hit the R button just, just yet. Okay, now your R button's pretty good. And Kairos uh, doing a good job not getting grabbed with these later percents. Um, I feel like a lot of people tunnel in terms of like, oh, I just don't get grabbed from Luigi at like sub 20, sub 30 or whatnot, right? But you have to watch out even at these higher percents. Down throw. Ooh, the drag though. Even crying pressure with jab, just in case. Up B, no. Uh, Elegant actually pulling back a little bit, yeah. expecting the up B. Oh, is that it? Oh, the down B, but the dash tech still not enough. Elegant is alive, 160. The air dodge is forced here. Uh, like that, going for the extended dash, or the extended death tilt. Okay, what's the play here? Okay, Kairos has the lead here, this game number two. Oh, the double up? Oh, sometimes you can hit that dare and get like two hits of it. Yeah, oh. I think he just did it a little bit too early just as a way to cover his landing, just yeah. in case Elegant wanted to try and challenge him. Here we go. Just, yep, get back to the stage. That's going to kill, especially with the platform assist. And of course, you can't get too greedy versus Luigi. That frame one intangibility on the down B. Going to get Luigi out. Ooh, beautiful parry on the second hit there. Up B out of shield up there to, uh, to confirm. Like this, yes. More projectiles, more projectiles, Kairos. Yeah, and uh, Elliot's doing a good job of like knowing when to come in and shield, like getting one dash shield, you know, maybe a walk shield. Oh, Ooh. going up on that platform just seems like so such a dangerous idea for Kairos. Off stage, this is where Elegant tries to pull the trigger, and I don't think that was bad. That actually, I agree with that um, decision. Just a tad bit off there, but he had the plunger as well. Um, he was like kind of behind us, you know what I mean? So yeah. going for the edge guard, don't think it was that bad of a decision, but just a tad bit off on some of the timings and some of the aerials. Kairos yeah. played it really well, obviously, and was able to make it back on stage and get the reverse up beat. Yes, yeah. I mean, applying that pressure into Kairos, like really challenging him off stage is something that Elegant needed to do in that scenario too, because he was down by, like, what, 70% at that point? He yeah. needed to make something happen. I mean, you could have you gone for the ledge trap too. Like, there, there was definitely safer ways to go about it, but Elegant did not go off stage too much, and to like right. try and close out the set like that is like a tad bit greedy. But I, I, I don't see like I don't think it's crazy. Like the risk reward adds up, right? Like you yes. get the stock, you win the game if you get that. Exactly. And then the set's over, and now we're moving on. But nope, here we are in game three on Battlefield. And you know what, Green? We're actually or Charles, we're actually getting a quite a bit of a a stage selection here. This is pretty nice. Ooh, this is a re-grab. Oh, uses the wall jump. Do we get a grab? Yes, we do. There's the pumble. Oh, dang. Okay. All right. We take that. 
That's unfortunate. That, and that, that is, I believe that's the second SD from Kairos, yep, yep. right? As well throughout Before this it was one piece, but uh, that is the second one for Kairos. Okay. And Elegant doing a great job. You can use fireballs or plungers to kind of like clank with your opponent's projectiles as long as they're not transcendent. Um, obviously, if this is like Wolf Blaster we're talking about, it would just go straight through. Mm -hmm. Okay, jumping from jumping from ledge with an air. Wow, I like that fair dog. That's smart. Yeah, look at the just yeah the, the spacing that we're seeing from Kairos with Nair is it's just making it so that he's either Kairos is able to approach or he's able to recover. He's able to do what he wants by sticking out his foot. Yeah. Even even like I feel like Elegant's been doing a great job at utilizing like when and where to go for neutral air dodge. He's been doing it a lot, just like obviously in juggle scenarios. Or, ooh, snatched up, up B. Oh, so ooh, close, but, but no, no punish. punish. No punish whatsoever as Cairo whips his up air. Here we go, we're back to our game. Ladies and gentlemen, this is it. Ooh, the trade? Okay, it works out in Kairos' favor here. Staying alive, taking quite a bit of damage. Here's the bomb explosion into the up smash. Yeah, in that scenario, you need to go for the ledge. The bomb's about to explode. Kairos is getting a little sloppy in terms of just like knowing when the bomb's gonna detonate. Yeah, you're probably expecting Elegant to really be throwing out those down tilts at the ledge because he has been for the most part when uh, when Kairos was getting close to the ledge. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. Where are we going? The 2021. Oh wow. Okay. Okay. He. He. Maybe, maybe Elegant just expected like hard DI in, and he just wanted to cover it. Gets, you know, 78 damage. It's still Can't quite complain a bit. about 78 damage. Cannot complain. Oh, oh. there's the offstage. You have the double jump. You the got bomb the bomb, though. Oh, tried to get the back air. Barely missed. Um, but really, really good positioning on Elegant's part there. Yeah. He at least went for it. Definitely had the correct idea. Kyro's able, oh, not only able to make it back, but able to regain some stage control as well by using the last hit of the spin attack to knock Elegant back. Giving himself a little bit of distance and putting him back in neutral. Here we go, more projectiles. This is the projectile war that we're seeing from Kairos. His Elegant fights his way to get, make it back in. Up smash, whips, boomerang, whips. And Elegant's content, man. I, I'm throwing plungers. I'm, I'm throwing out the, the slap center stage. The dash <laughs> attack, is it enough? Yes, it is. Just waiting for that opening. Elegant doing a really great job closing it out. Man. So was that the green light? Was, that, was the green light for his dash attack as he slowly approached Kairos? was actually the plunger clanking with the arrow. Yeah, I mean, Elegant just did a really great job of utilizing the plunger not to actually hit his opponent, but just kind of trade with uh, Projecto. I'm back, baby. He's, He's back, back, baby. Elegant's back. He even, he even took his slogan. Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> Rip Kong Kong. <laughs> I mean, shout out to all the Luigi's. They, yeah, they yeah. obviously help each other out. They um, do. Like, that's. I remember back in the day, old man talk, back in my day. Back in Back uh, in my day, Kong Kong <laughs> said he's back. Kong Kong used to say he, he ripped off his shirt when he would say that. <laughs> I didn't see any shirt ripping here. Come on, step up your game, Elegant. <laughs> uh, no, but like there was always talk like, oh, you know, I wonder, like, I bet all the Luigi's hate each other because they're always competing. No, they actually all help each other. They communicate. They give each other tips like, what do you do in this situation? What do you do? I feel like most character communities are like friends with each other or at least like mm -hmm. know each other within like